In the 1980s, Suzuki's first proper SUV arrived in India as a Maruti Suzuki Gypsy. For the next couple of decades, it continued to go places where most everyday cars would shy from. In the process, it became an icon and also set the strong foundation for its future iterations, the latest of which we see now in India, the Jimny. The SUV currently sells in 200 countries across the world, predominantly in the 3 door version. It was launched in India earlier this year in this never seen before 5 door version that is more apt for the Indian buyer. But the India launch generated quite an interest for this bigger version. Maruti Suzuki has already started exporting the SUV to many countries and even Japan, the birthplace of this marquee, gets the 5 door version from India. The Maruti Suzuki Gurugram plant might be the oldest but the line on which the chimney is being made is claimed to be the most modern. It is only the second in the world where Suzuki assembles a ladder frame chassis car using over 1500 parts. It is as automated as automotive production lines get. The crucial start is making the ladder frame on which the powertrain gets fitted. Welding is a delicate and risky process, hence Maruti Suzuki employs around 38 robots for the job. Together, there are approximately 3,200 welding points which ensure the uniform structural rigidity expected for something that will be treated less delicately than other cars. There are two assembly lines that work simultaneously for the cabin and chassis. The two come together, married by a robot and of course before heading to the paint shop and then demerge and head to the individual lines before finally coming together once again. While it is a sight to behold, what may get overlooked by anyone watching this process is the amount of digitization with information being collected and if need be process corrected in the real time. This also will ensure that if any issue is detected at a later date, Maruti Suzuki is able to correctly identify and the date and parts used. An interesting sight at these lines are automatic guided vehicles that transfer various parts to the designated areas around the shop floor. These self-charging machines stop automatically if there's an obstacle in their path and start moving only if the path is clear. Once the chimney is prepared, it goes through multiple checks to ensure it's working just the way it is supposed to. These include physical inspections, drum test at 120 km per hour, long road test, short road test and interestingly also a heavy shower test which has the same intensity as the one seen in Meghalaya's Chirapunji, one of the wettest places on earth. For the record, there are four Jimny variants on sale in India but at the factory it makes no less than 93. So most of these are for large export markets. For a layman, the Gurugram plant can be mind-boggling as it makes everything from a seemingly ubiquitous alto to a global star like the chimney. The latter currently accounts for nearly 20% of its 1 lakh annual production. And making the chimney production rather unique is that there are no foreign suppliers. All 177 vendors contracted for the 5-door chimney are Indian. The SUV is indeed a shining example of how far automotive manufacturing has progressed in India and can now be counted alongside the best in the world. Mm -hmm.